as a ministry to satisfy you. There's something we call food satisfaction. Yes. To satisfy that which you give to the public that patronize you. It is our responsibility to look at your kitchen environment where you stay and prepare these foods. Because some hotels do a lot of, you know, face lifting. Go inside and go into the kitchen where they prepare what you and I eat. You will never accept to eat such a food. So it is the responsibility of our ministry to inspect these areas and ensure that the proper thing is being done. I have stayed in a hotel where you sleep almost every night. You find rodents, rats. So find please. That tells you that such a hotel is never fumigated. All these things are important because most of these things that we are talking about are we are only trying to prevent disease because they say prevention is better than uh, cure. Of course, if you are, we don't just come and we ask you to begin to pay. If we discover anything, we give we serve you an abatement notice. Give you time within which you are expected to correct what we have discovered. By the time we come back, if you have done it, you don't have any problem. But if you fail to do it, then the government will pounce on you. So, I have only come to say, please, let us try and get it right. It's not even only hotel. Whoever prepares whatever we eat, even the roadside people, will go after them. I remember those days when we were little boys in the commercial city of Aba. There were these people we used to call Ngo Lala, right? The, we call them uh, hygiene, environmental health officers. They go about. You're preparing food, you are selling akara or whatever. It's expected you should be covered and so many, and so many other things. Some of these things are the things we are trying to bring back. So for the hotel managers, the load is on you to ensure that your people did the right thing. Very soon, we have started, we'll be visiting the hotels. So that when you see us, you should please receive us. We are partners in progress. Please receive us, we are partners in progress. We have only come to stay, to see how well they are doing. And if there be anything we feel they are not doing correctly, we'll tell you that at, we think this should be done this way. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much, sir. Well, the Honorable Commissioner has said it all. He that has ears, let him hear. And as he rightly mentioned, if you enter into the kitchen of most hotels, restaurants, you will never go hungry again. You will not want to eat anything that comes out of that place. And it is the duty of the government to ensure that you're safe, we don't get into any kind of pandemic or calamity or, you know, all those meetings, endemics, you can just add the one that you know. But the ministry and the commission is ready to help. And most times, you never see commissioners coming to tell you these things that he's just said. They sit down in their office and say, they will write to whom it may concern. But our Honorable Commissioner is here today to give us this information himself. I think he deserves another round of applause. <laughs> and for being so good and protective of our health, we have this for you, sir. Yes. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. <laughs>